Hi friends, I'm Pastor Diana. Welcome to A Daily Devotion. I am so glad that you are taking a few moments to invite God to be present with you this day. This week, we are continuing our journey on legacy and considering how we leave our mark on the world. And most of all, this week, we are focusing on what it means to celebrate our past and how we recognize it, even when it may not be totally okay, but knowing that God is present, God is there. And you know, one of the things about legacy is that it is something that takes a pretty long time. Legacy is not something that happens fast at all because a legacy is built up little by little, moment by moment, one thing after another. And you know, sometimes we really want things to happen really quickly. So let me read a pithy, pithy proverb to you um, from chapter 28. These are like sayings that kind of give good advice. They're part of our wisdom literature. And this one's focused really on finances, but I think can apply to a lot of things about legacy. 2820 says, reliable people will have abundant blessings. But those with get-rich-quick schemes won't go unpunished. You know, one of the things in life that's hard is wanting to cut corners, wanting to make things happen more quickly, wanting to have things happen faster. faster. And sometimes that works out. Sometimes there's no consequences, right? But if you do it too much, you're probably going to mess up a little bit. And you know, that's one of the things about legacy. You might be going through this and be like, okay, full steam ahead. I'm going to leave an amazing legacy. But no, that's not what a legacy is. It's a mark. It's a step. It's a race. It's one thing at a time. It's a race of endurance. It's inherited faith. It's considering your past, both the beneficial and the things that you need to let go of. It's hearing different perspectives and it is being, showing up, being reliable day after day after day. And that, that is a legacy that is filled with abundant blessings. So today, I want you to consider your past week. How have you shown up? How have you made a mark, a little mark? You can't do, most people can't do really big things in a week. How have you made a little mark in your life, in your family's life, in the world? And know that it is one little mark, even if it's a pinprick, at a time that builds over time and lets you leave a legacy. So consider, consider what legacy you want to leave and what legacy you are leaving as you journey forward. Will you pray with me? Gracious and loving God, we give you thanks for this time of reflection, for your words of wisdom, for your challenge, and for your reminder of your continued presence. Be with us now. Help us to journey forward and let us leave a legacy that reflects your abundant love. Amen. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me on this journey. I am so glad that you've taken some time. Please like and subscribe to uh, the channel. Share this video if it meant something to you. And most of all, make sure you don't miss next week's. And join us at church on Sunday, whether online or in person. We hope to see you there. Most of all, have a blessed day.